Here we go side by side again, the battle for second. Harvick just cannot hold the throttle in it when he's down that low. Yeah, the first time we've really seen him be down on the bottom side. That was a little surprising. I think he just wanted to show Denny something a little bit different and try something. All right, here comes Harvick. He's got a run and oh, oh wonder what he was going to do with that run. Yeah, I thought he might try that inside one more time, but he just thought he'd send a message. Well, then he came up, shut the door, and he said, excuse me, I'd like to reopen it. Yeah, he's going to try it one more time. Hamlin's pretty good off of four. He's been able to keep him behind him, even with the big run that Harvick gets. Don't forget, the wins count for bonus points going into the chase. That's what makes this battle so important right now. This is a 20-point swing for Kevin Harvick. If he can keep uh, Denny Hamlin from winning this race, and he gets the win, he takes 10 points away from Hamlin and gives them to Harvick. Going to get another run off of two right here. Hamlin with five victories got this year, and here he comes yeah, down he got the back stretch. He just had too much momentum, and if uh, Hamlin tried to cut that move off, it might have been trouble. And that's what that bump the last time sent that message. Well, it's still not clear because It'll Hamlin's be clear here. running the low line, and here we come out of four. Let's yeah, see Hamlin struggling for grip down there. Oh, got a good close-up of the uh, Shell logo on the side of the car. And he does find the clearing. So that is our 17th away, lead change. Marks, drive away. You can't catch it. And for Harvick, as he comes to the strike, it'll be his third win of 2010.